Let's say you want to take a classy lady out on a date to an art gallery, but you're not such a classy guy. Well, I'm Nate Gear, and I'm here to give you a crash course in art. There are three main things you want to consider when you're looking at art. Style, balance, and symmetry. So let's say you go to an art gallery and you see work similar to this. This is a great example of abstract expressionism. What is abstract expressionism? It's pretty much just drizzle art. If you drizzle paint on a canvas, that's abstract expressionism. The other thing to look at is the color. This piece is mostly blue and yellow being contrasting colors it kind of, it pops, it gives you, you know, and then that dirty black kind of makes it more street and more urban. When you're looking at art, there are things to consider. It's asymmetrical, it's symmetrical. These are something, this is a point you could make when you're looking at a piece like this. I really enjoy the symmetry of this work, or I really don't like the symmetry of this work. It's too stagnant. It's not working for me, you know what I mean? It's okay to not like art, that's another great, Thing to remember, you can not like the work you're looking at when you go to an art gallery. All art is inherently subjective. It's all about you, the viewer. People mostly like abstract expressionism because of the energy. When you move in that, that speed, you get an energy that gets lost when you slow down and drag a brush across the canvas. So what did we learn today in this crash course in art? We learned about Jackson Pollock and the abstract expressionists, you know, that drizzle painting style. We also learned about color and symmetry, the balance of a piece. So now with all this new information, next time you go to an art gallery, you won't look like as big of a novice.